Let's look at the solution for our BTB quiz. The question was which BTB entry is used for a particular PC. It might seem easy because we need 10 bits to index into this BTB, so we will just take the least significant 10 bits of this PC and index into the BTB with that. However, note that instructions are fixed size, 4 bytes, and word aligned, which means that not all addresses are possible for the program counter. If you now look at what would happen if we use the least significant 10 bits to index into the BTB, we would see that the entry number 0 would be used. An instruction can have the least significant 10 bits be all 0. Entry number 1, however, requires the least significant 10 bits to be 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1. And that entry cannot be used because the instructions are word aligned. As we said, addresses such as all zeros and then just one are not possible. Basically, all addresses actually need to be not only even, but also divisible by four. So if you take the lowermost bits, that means that the only possible instruction addresses are of the form something, 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 and then the least significant two bits are zero. That means that we are really using only every fourth entry in our BTB. Pretty much of the 1024 entry BTB, we are really using only 256 entries, which is a huge waste. So in this case, what should happen is we should not use the least significant 10 bits, and instead we use these 10 bits, so they're the least significant bits that can be different among instructions. Basically, these bits are always zero, so they're just going to waste entries. We need to take the least significant 10 bits that are still different among different instructions. So in this case, our instruction has bits C is 1100, zero, zero, 0 is 0000, zero, zero, zero. B is 1011. We're going to ignore these two bits and take the next 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 bits. So this is the index into our BTB. And now let's convert that to hex. This would be the first hex digit, so it would be 3. This would be the next hex digit, so it would be C. And this would be 2. So we are talking about the entry number 2C3.